The Galaxy S5 may be Samsung's flagship smartphone for 2014, but it's the Galaxy Alpha that's running away with our hearts at IFA 2014. Join us for a quick trade show comparison from Berlin. Spoiler alert, TouchWiz is basically identical between these devices, so this quick comparison is all about the hardware. It's not just a difference in size, but footprint definitely plays a part. The 4.7 inch display on the Alpha is just a touch smaller, but it makes possible a hugely reduced footprint on the Alpha compared to the 5.1 inch S5. Really, it's more the material and build differences that make the Alpha so special. Where the S5 feels a bit like a fluffy pillow with its plastic on plastic construction, the Galaxy Alpha is hard edged with sharp beveling on its metal side rails and a color choice and backplate finish that makes it much more attractive to our eyes. And the fact that you can wrap your whole hand around it is a great bonus if you value one handed use with your pretty fit and finish. Whether this cosmetic improvement is worth all the sacrifices in power will be up to you. The resolution comes down from Full HD to 720p on the Alpha, the Snapdragon on the S5 gets transmuted into an Exynos Octa, the camera takes a step down from 16 to 12 megapixels, and the battery gets a huge demotion from 2800 to 1860 milliamp hours, which is almost frightening. Also, the Alpha isn't water or dust resistant, so it's not for the clumsy or the super active. But even with all those sacrifices, and probably a few more, which we'll discover in a full comparison later in the year, it'd still be mighty tempting for the aesthetic appreciators on our team to choose beauty over power in this case. Which one would you pick? Let us know in the comments below, and stay tuned for many more quick show floor comparisons as Taylor Martin and I bring you more from IFA 2014 in the days ahead. Till next time, this has been Michael Fisher with Pocket Now, Captain Two Phones on Twitter. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.